What's up, Aver family? Heath Beringer here with the director of golf, Ben Potter, at the beautiful Danville Golf Club. Um, a bit of a, a title switch up, you know, there for you with the addition of, of the women's program. Um, how excited are you to, to see that program develop? Um, and how are you know just excited are you for, for the whole program in general? Yeah, I mean, we're just super excited to have, have women's golf here on campus. Um, I think it was something that it was time for. Uh, it's been in talks for the last couple of years now, and you know, golf has been a, a major part of the university for, right. for a long time. Probably one of the oldest sports teams still play and right. is still going on, right. and uh, just kind of the addition and, and trying to go, grow the women's game at the same time. Um, something that I've wanted to do since I've been on campus, and it was, it was finally time, and we were able to get it done. Uh, I'm super excited to see how they grow. I know we're only in our first year, so we're going to keep taking the small steps, and uh, hopefully in a few years we'll be right where the men's team is. Right, and it taught, you know it takes takes time to develop a program, and you said it right into the um, to the men's team, ranked 17th preseason from uh, Bushnell and uh, Golf Week preseason poll. I mean, you know, what about this roster from maybe years past or um, you know other teams? kind of makes them stand out and have that you know preseason ranking in the top 25 yeah I, th I think we're just deeper right. um, you know we got a lot of returners coming in and that helps uh, guys that were my first recruiting class are now juniors so they're upperclassmen now uh, but we've got 12 guys on the team right now that I'm not afraid to run out there right um, I think that's different in the past couple of teams and I think that's just me being here longer and kind of getting guys in and kind of we still got Michael Allen who's a six-year senior <laughs> so he, he's still around and just having anybody that's been around college golf that long is also going to help but just the depth I mean we're out here qualifying today and just you know we got a lot of guys bunched up at the top looking to kind of kind of make the van um, it's just it's just time. I think it's time. The guys are getting older and, you know, the, hopefully the longer you stay at Avery University, the better you get. And then that transitions into a better team. Right. Iron, iron sharpens iron. Exactly. That's what I've been taught. So that depth is, uh, you know, always key. So, you know, going into this, this year, what tournaments are you most excited about? I know probably the the coach's cliche answer, but the, but the next one. <laughs> um, but yeah, That's the right answer. Yeah, but we've we've got a great schedule this fall. Uh, you know, we're starting off in Florida. Uh, we'll be in Georgia, right outside of Atlanta, then back to Florida, and then in Greensboro. We really, the Division Three ranks, you can't ask for a better schedule than what we've got this year. Uh, we're going to see a lot of the top teams every time we step out of the van, uh, no matter where we're at. Uh, so really right now we're just focused on getting ready for, for the first event and then once that one's done we'll start looking at the next one. Um, but yeah, just really excited for, for the whole schedule as a um, as whole body of work and what we have a chance to do. Right. So if you had to give a few keys, or maybe it's just one key, what mm. does your program need to do to be successful this year? Mm. Uh, I think we got to stay within ourselves. I think that's kind of last year we jumped out and had a we had a good fall. Uh, we're not traveling, but around here we were able to get some stuff done and put in a lot of hard work. Uh, and then coming back last spring, having the schedule and getting off to a good start in Savannah and, and jumping up inside the top 10 in the nation, I think was really good. But I think as, a, as an entire team, we didn't handle it bad, but we didn't handle it great. Right. Um, I think it's one of those things we got to realize the, the more success you have, the harder you got to continue the work. Right. Um, so I think it's just something staying within ourselves and understanding our process, uh, not really caring about what other teams are doing uh, outside of tournaments, and really just focusing on what what it takes for us to be successful. Right, well, Ben, thanks for your time. Uh, golf team opens up the season September 19th at Mission Inn in Orlando, Florida, like you talked about. Um, so you said y'all have qualifying today. Um, I'm ready to go. Uh, you know, we go out there, how many strokes are you going to give me? I mean, we going to get after it or what? I gave you six last time and you lost, so we might have to give you seven today. It was in a playoff, okay. So uh, that's it. Director of Golf, Ben Potter, opens up uh, in Florida September 19th.